So you go ahead and you have your blueberries put into your crust. You go ahead and fold over your top crust into fourths. Go ahead and lay it and then open it up. Go ahead and flip this part over. It looks like it needs to be moved down a little. Slowly fold it over. And then you're gonna wanna pinch the two crusts together and then tuck it under. Pinch the two crusts together and tuck it under. Pinch those two crusts together, tuck it under. And I pinch them together, tuck it under. You do that all the way around. You want to get a seal created so the pie doesn't bubble out, make a mess in your oven. But yeah, you want enough crust there to tuck it under. And this comes with time also. The, the more you do it, you know how much crust you need on the edges to tuck it under. But that is the key to getting a nice seal. And then you can go around and make a design with your fingers pinching it, or you can use a fork to make a design. But you just kind of lay your thumb down and your two fingers and give it a pinch. And that's about all there is to making a pie. One trick, sprinkle a little sugar on the top crust and then dribble some milk and that makes for a pretty brown crust on top. And then you bake it at 400 degrees for 15 minutes to help the crust brown and then you turn it down to 350 and let it cook the rest of the time for 45 minutes. So 15 minutes at 400 degrees to get that crust to brown, and then turn the temperature down to 350 and let it bake for another 45 minutes. Then you dribble that milk after you put a little sugar on top and just spread that milk around and it's ready to bake. Enjoy your pie. Put a little ice cream on it. See you later.